Working with venomous snakes over the years, it still surprises me that people sell venom extraction kits in stores. On my recent travels, somebody brought one of these along. This is a venom extraction kit. These kits can actually do more harm than good. They come with the venom extractor or two suction cups. They also come with a tourniquet for tying off the outer extremity of the body that was bitten. Using a tourniquet on a snake bite is one of the worst things anybody could ever do. Applying a tourniquet to the outer extremity will cause the venom to be localized in that limb. Without any blood flow through the limb itself, the venom will deteriorate all the tissue and also destroy the bone cells. If you use the razor blade to cut open the bite site, you can actually wind up with a secondary infection and excessive bleeding. The suction cups that also come with these snake bite kits don't do much good at all. When the venom is sitting in the area of the bite site, the residual venom cannot be absorbed into the body through dead tissue. So sucking the venom out really doesn't do any good. I have been bitten over 60 times by venomous snakes. Never once have I had to use one of these kits. My personal advice in the use of a kit like this is throw it away. There are only two things you have to do when bitten by a venomous snake. The first thing is remain as calm as possible. The second thing is get to the hospital as quickly as possible. A lot of people ask me, what's the difference between poison and venom? The difference between poison and venom is this. If venom is injected into the bloodstream, it can cause death. If venom is taken orally, it is completely harmless. Venom is actually saliva. It is modified through the gland of the snake. It is composed of enzymes and proteins. If taken orally, it is neutralized by the stomach acids and is completely harmless. If poison is injected into the bloodstream, it can cause death. If poison is taken orally, it can also cause death. And that is the difference between venom and poison. What I have here is a champagne glass for a small demonstration. What I'm going to do is extract venom and drink it. What I have here in my hand is an Eastern Diamondback Rattlesnake. We're going to extract venom from this snake into the champagne glass. The yellow secretion you see coming through the fangs is actual venom. Snakes actually have teeth like sharks. They'll actually recede their old fangs with new fangs. They constantly grow fangs to replace the old ones. So sometimes we'll see two fangs in one spot. One functional, one non-functional. What is venom? Venom is actually saliva. Saliva that is modified in the gland of the snake. The modification of this saliva creates venom. Venom is composed of enzymes and proteins. These enzymes and proteins are naturally found in your own saliva. If taken orally, venom is completely harmless. I'm going to apply water to the venom to make it taste a little better and then swallow it. Bottoms up.
tastes kind of bitter. Helps in the digestion.